Hello, I'm Ederson Oliveira. I'll be presenting this video for dnnhere.com. In this video, I'll be showing how you can set up a fixed uh, vertical menu on your .NET Hook website. So what do I mean by a fixed vertical menu? If we go here to our test site, I did have set up a couple of pages to exemplify what I'm talking about. For instance, About Us. Under About Us, I have created three pages. And one of those pages has also a set of sub-pages. Under Events, I also have a couple of pages under that. So let's say that if you navigate to the About Us menu, but let's say that you want to see the sub-navigation, not only if you move the mouse over the menu, but actually you would like to see it in the right side, sorry, in the left side of the website, let's say in this area here on the, on the left side, you want to go to the top menu and you want to see the sub-navigation being displayed all the time on the left side of the page. So you can do that by using this module called Navigation Suite, it's a module from DNN 3, 360, and there are a couple of tools within this, this package, but I want to focus on one particular module called a CISS Side Menu. So I have this module locally. When you purchase this module, you, can, you will receive this zip file. If you open the zip file, you're going to see a bunch of more files inside of it. I'm going to start digging into those files, but I, I want to focus on one of those. The one that says unzip me. So I'm going to open this one as well. I'm going to just hit open. Now it has more files inside of it. It has a, a guide as well. Now the file that I'm going to install is this one here called navigation suite. I'm going to extract it to my folder. Here it is. I'm going to copy the location. I'm going to go to my test site, log in as super user so I can install this module. And the way we install it is the, the usual way under host, module definitions, under the action menu, and then click install module, click browse, go to the folder. Here is the zip file navigation suite and click open, hit next, hit next again. So that's called CISS side menu, hit next once more, accept license, hit next. Let's have a look if everything went fine. So it installs a bunch of themes as well. Yeah, everything should be, seems to be fine. Let's click return. Now let's have a look here in the list of modules. So here's a module called CISS side menu. Now one, one note to be said is that this module can also be used as a skin um, object. So it can be used directly in the skin, but it's not the case here. In our case, we're gonna use it as a regular module. So I'm just gonna go to the About Us page. And as I said, I want to add to the left side a sidebar navigation that I can see all the menus under the about us in our first case here. So let's go to the module drop down. Let's select CISS side menu. Here it is. I'm going to add to the left pane and I'm going to add it there. Now this module comes already with a set of of themes and of course you can either use one of the pre pre uh, established themes or you can design your own if you are, if you know CSS, if you know style sheet, so if you know those aspects of uh, website development, um, so you can definitely create your own style. But I'm, we, we're just gonna be experimenting with the templates and the styles that comes already with the module. So as you can see here, it's already showing the full navigation, but we don't want that. We want to show the the about us navigation. So we want just to see this side of the navigation here. So let's go to the settings of this module. So under the action menu, let's go to settings. So under the settings, we can scroll all the way down. And 
the first option it's called uh, display style so there are lots of different styles to choose from we're just gonna be exploring some of those but not right now there are some more important settings that i want to mention it you can define how many levels you want to display maximum right now it's set to three let's leave it like that use tabs title width show hidden page or not this is important if you want to show hidden page or not in that structure now uh, start from level zero right now it's set to zero yeah i can i can specify this the the level that i want i can also say that i want to expand yes or 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 no true or false actually and how deep i want it to go and i can select the the what is the root in our case, I can specify that the root the root element will be about us. So I'm going to select about us. I can also check and check if I want to show admin and host menus as well. I can exclude tabs. Again, very, very flexible this module. So let's the only thing that we have changed right now is we have selected about us. Let's hit update. And now I should be able to see only the about us options now let's let's play a little bit with the template let's go back there and select something else of course as i said you can change those templates let's select one let's select a vertical vertical phoenix here just to see how how this goes so again a new a new style may maybe what you want may not be what you want but bottom line is that you can open the site files in my case i'm opening via windows explorer and i can open the site i can go to desktop modules i can go to ciss side menu to styles folder and i can play around here i can create more styles i can copy one of those styles rename it and start playing around with the css and the excel x sl files as well now again you will only do that if you know what you are doing if you know css if you know how to do those things now this is not the purpose of this video let's play a little bit more with the settings that are available now let's go back to another vertical let's call it let's select this uh pure css this module also support uh, some of the standard dot that took modules like uh, the store catalog so it can integrate well with that and let's also select under expand let's set this to true and let's put uh, deep as two levels let's click update now we should be able to see the entire tree of the navigation under about us as you can see we can see our team our company and then under our company you can see sales marketing accounting as you can see here they are all visible from here now most likely it does it will require some styling to match your site look and feel but but this is a well-known navigation uh, module so you can find many providers that will will work with you in that module in case you are not versatile enough in terms of css so basically this is a quick overview of the css side menu from 360 and you can find it on snow covered and with that module you can set up a side navigation for your dotnet network websites that will show the sub navigation options of the top menus so that's it for now thank you very much and bye